Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Did you know that your phone is constantly tracking your activity, monitoring which apps you use, what you type, and even what you search for on the internet? And here's something even more shocking. It could be listening to your conversations. These tracking features are enabled by default on every Android phone, draining your battery, slowing down your device, and collecting your data without you even realizing it. But don't worry, I've got you covered. In today's video, I'll show you how to disable three hidden settings that are quietly spying on you. Before we jump in, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more tech tips to keep your devices fast and secure. All right, without further ado, let's dive in. Step 1. Disable personalization using shared data. Your phone collects and shares your data with multiple apps to personalize your experience. But what it's really doing is spying on everything you do. This means every time you open an app, browse the web, or type a message, your activity is being recorded and analyzed to tailor ads and recommendations to you. Not only is this an invasion of privacy, but it also takes up valuable system resources which slows down your phone and drains the battery. Here is how you can disable it. Open settings on your phone. Scroll down and tap on Google. Select all services, scroll down. Under privacy and security, tap on personalize using shared data. Here you'll see a list of apps with access to your shared data. Some of these may include messaging apps, social media, and even shopping apps. Simply turn off all the apps on this list. By doing this, you're preventing them from tracking your behavior, which means they won't be able to collect and use your data to send targeted ads or recommendations. This will also free up processing power on your device, helping it run more efficiently. Now let's move to the second step. Step two, disable usage and diagnostics. Stop Google from collecting your usage data. Google constantly tracks how you use your phone, which apps you open, how long you spend on them, and even when your phone crashes. This data is then sent back to Google to help improve their services. While this may seem helpful, it means that your phone is always running background processes to send this data, which results in slower performance and shorter battery life. How to turn it off, go back to the privacy and security section in Google settings. Tap on Usage and Diagnostics. You'll see an option to toggle it on or off. Switch it off to stop Google from collecting unnecessary data. By doing this, your phone won't be sending continuous reports to Google, which reduces background activity and allows your device to run more smoothly. Plus, this helps protect your privacy by limiting the amount of personal data being shared. Step 3. Stop ads from tracking you. Prevent ads from spying on you. Have you ever talked about something near your phone only to see an ad for it minutes later? That's because Google uses your microphone and other data to serve you targeted ads. This happens because your phone listens for certain keywords in your conversations and uses that information to tailor advertisements. For example, if you mention that you need new running shoes, you might suddenly see ads for sneakers appearing in your social media feed or browser. Here is how you can stop it. Go back to Settings and open Google. Tap on All Services. Under the Privacy and Security section, select Ads. Tap on Reset Advertising ID to erase all the tracking data associated with your device. A confirmation pop-up will appear. Press Confirm to proceed. After that, tap on Delete Advertising ID to permanently remove your unique ad tracking identifier. Once done, you may notice an option to get new advertising ID, but avoid enabling it as this will generate a fresh tracking ID, allowing personalized ads to resume. By disabling your advertising ID, you effectively stop Google and third-party advertisers from serving targeted ads based on your browsing history, reducing the likelihood of targeted ads appearing in your apps and searches. By disabling these three settings, you will make your phone faster by reducing background processes that slow it down. Extend your battery life by preventing unnecessary data transmission. 
Keep your personal data private by limiting how much information Google and other apps can collect about you. And that is it for this video. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more privacy and tech tips. Also, let me know in the comments, have you ever noticed ads popping up right after talking about something? Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.